intervals of monotonicity, we say that the function f of x increasing for x1 less than x2, the function at x1 less than f of function at x2, the function f is decreasing on the interval if x1 less than x2, then the f of x1 greater than f of x2. We say the function f is the constant on the interval for any x1 and x2, the function value of those x1 and x2 are the same. Let's look at the example. Find and identify the open intervals for the monotonicity where the function is increasing, decreasing, and constant. When we look at the graph, the graph is rising on the left and then falling on the right. So the rising means increasing. So we say increasing. Interval going to be from negative infinity to the point negative 4 and then decreasing on the interval negative 4 all the way to positive infinity. And for the graph in part B, for any two x value, the y values are the same. In this case, no increasing, no decreasing, just a constant. For the entire domain, which is from negative infinity to positive infinity. In part C, the function mx equals absolute value of x minus 3. Based on the transformation, the graph has shifted to the right three units. From the more basic function graph of the absolute value, one, two, three, one, two, three. So after we plot the graph, we can see that the graph is decreasing on the left side of three and increasing on the right side of x equals three. So we say increasing on the interval three, infinity, decreasing negative infinity to the number three, and no constant function, no constant term.